Well now, I didn't expect to see this this morning. So Nintendo sent out a PR email uh, listing off all of the downloads for this week in the United States. They also do this in Europe and other countries. But the United States one is particularly interesting because nestled in the end of the email, when they say, also new this week, and they're just listing off a bunch of titles. This is usually where you find all of the indie titles. Uh, example, it'll do two, Uno, Rhyme, Batman, the Telltale series. Lego, Marvel, Super Heroes 2, etc., etc., etc. Nestled in there, right after Koei DX, which is coming to the Nintendo eShop on Nintendo Switch, is Hulu coming on the Nintendo eShop on Nintendo Switch. And this is slated for, I don't know when. <laughs> uh, some people are saying that it's coming the, today. Some people are saying that it's coming later this week or next week. I don't know, but... It is coming out within the next seven days, possibly today. I'm going to be checking my eShop all day today because I use Hulu. Uh, my subscription is currently inactive, but I will reactivate it since I can use it on Nintendo Switch. Now, why this is important is because it would mark the first video-on-demand application to run on Nintendo Switch natively in the United States. Now, in Japan, they have been running Nico Nico, which is like their version of YouTube. Uh, it's interesting that this is happening now because a lot of the rumors and speculation around why video on demand it hasn't launched yet is because Nintendo was waiting to launch their online service, their Nintendo paid online service for 20 bucks a year. Not that Hulu, Netflix, and all that stuff would be hidden behind that service, but maybe there'd be better infrastructure in place for those applications to launch at that time. But with Hulu launching now, it begs the question... Where are the other video on demand services? Now, we have heard rumors in the past that Netflix, like the Netflix app, has been ready to go on Switch this whole time, and they're just waiting for Nintendo to say, Yeah, you can do it. Now, we don't know, obviously, it's a rumor. We cannot confirm that that's the case, but with Hulu coming out, you have to start wondering where is Netflix? Where is YouTube? Where are these other services that are actually bigger than Hulu? Where's Amazon Prime? I don't know. The only thing I can think of right now is Nintendo might be trying to slow roll out these services. So if we get Hulu this week, next week maybe we get YouTube, the week after we get Netflix, the week after we get, uh, I don't know, Amazon Prime, or maybe they in include Voodoo, uh, you know, maybe they start opening the floodgates to even that. Personally, I would love to see them support DirecTV now, since that's how I watch cable TV services. But yeah, this is awesome. Like Nintendo... Thank you very much for finally, at least starting out with Hulu, how to get the Hulu app launched on Switch. Again, at the time of me recording this, it has not launched yet. Rumors are saying it's coming today, but the PR email does not list a date for it. It just says it is coming this week. Uh, and since all, some of the other titles go through no November 14th, uh, you can assume that it's sometime in the next six days or so we are going to see this. So from Thursday to Thursday, we have a shot at getting Hulu. Not even a shot. It's a guaranteed shot. Nintendo's advertising it. Now, it's always possible they accidentally slip that in there and Hulu isn't going to launch. But so far, every single email they have sent out like this, since Switch released all of the titles in those emails have released in that week. So there's no reason not to believe this. This comes from the horse's mouth. Uh, let me know if you're excited for Hulu. I know I am. I have a few shows that I'm a little behind on. I've been trying to catch up with them on DirecTV Now, but admittedly, Hulu is almost a better DVR service than DirecTV Now is. Uh, DirecTV Now is great for live stuff. I actually only have DirecTV Now, so I can ha have access to like, HBO and all that stuff for relatively cheap. And on top of that, I get access to watch all of my live sports, like my Milwaukee Bucks this season, but and Green Bay Packers. Can't forget about them. But... Even though they're sucking this year. Yay! Aaron Rodgers is hurt. No. But Hulu is always my go-to place. Like, hey, if I missed one of my favorite shows, I can go to Hulu and I can catch it almost instantaneously after the show completes. Anyways, folks, let me know what you think about this down in the comments below. And when you think we're going to start getting the other video on demand services, are you excited to finally, after all this time, have this stuff coming to Switch? I am Nathaniel Rovajance from Nintendo Prime. And if you like this video, you know what to do. And if you dislike this video hit that dislike button subscribe for more content just like this and hey why don't you check out our giveaway down in the comments below or the comments the description below 
Uh, there's a gleam.io link for our Nintendo Switch AAA three pack giveaway of LA Noir, Doom, and Skyrim that ends at the end of this month. Check it out, enter. It's completely free. Uh, the only you know stipulations that is that you have to be old enough to receive the games. So whatever rating the game has in your given country, you must be you know at that age or higher. Uh, you also must be at a proper age in your given country for giveaways. I know there are some countries that don't allow giveaways. You have to check with your local officials. Anyways, folks, I will catch you in the next one. Nah. <laughs>